Welcome back to Definitely Not Definitive. I'm Ken. And I'm Bethany. And we're just a couple of goofballs in love that love doing some reaction videos together. Yes, we do. And so we're checking out uh, Bloodborne today. We're checking out a boss battle from Bloodborne. Uh, yeah, it'll be our first boss battle for a uh, Soulsborne game uh, from Software Games. Uh, so, you know, we've heard that the, the boss battles are epic and that uh, they're very frustrating and a lot of controllers have been damaged over the years through, <laughs> through playing these games. Let's do it. All right, so this is the uh, Bloodborne uh, Ludwig, the Holy Blade boss battle. Holy blade. Yeah. Okay. All right, I guess screw that guy. You just walk right past him. <laughs> We're on a mission. Yeah. We're on a mission from God. Oof. That's a lot of blood. I think so. Knows right exactly where to hit it. I didn't realize how much damage he had take, been taken. Oh, yeah. Ludwig just has not taken a ton of damage. Yeah. Because he's like stamina or something? Oh, damn! Is someone some ghost to fight beside him? Yeah, there's, there's something else in there with him. Ghost army? This is gonna suck. <laughs> Damn. Ooh. Oh man, when that gets you. Mm -hmm. Like cut his life in half. Oof. Oh, jeez. Oh, 
King getting shots in, just dodging the entire time. It's a lot of patience. Like, like a spear. Or yeah. To... This random ghost just trying to hit him with like whack a mole. <laughs> Okay, there you go. That was a good one. I need some shoes. Music song. <laughs> Freaking perfect. Mm -hmm. Ooh. So close, so close! You got it, dude, you got it. Oh. Prey slaughtered. Okay. Didn't realize Ludwig was the prey. Okay, uh, that was uh, that was intense for our first boss battle in a uh, Soulsborne game. What do you think? So the first thing that struck me was um, the scream that mm -hmm. Ludwig does. I mean, it just sounded like that blood curdling, gut wrenching scream of like a tortured creature. Um, yeah, and I just felt like that was such a great choice and such an interesting choice for a character that is it is our 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 demon, our evil entity, and yet uh, definitely seems like a twisted and tortured soul. Yeah, I think that's a great way to say it, is that like, yes, it is a, it is a demon or, or whatever. I assume it's it's evil. Like, I don't know, like, unless we're the evil ones hunting this prey. Um, but like, what the holy blade that like sort of came to it, um, it's like, there you are. Like, I, I've been searching for you. Um, I'm sort of con like interested in the connection between that to learn like the, the lore. Now I want to check out a lore video about uh, Ludwig and the Holy Blade and see like what the connection is to it to his Holy Blade and how he became this twisted form of uh, of a creature. Um, and I mean, might, maybe it's a mercy that uh, going around killing these things. It you're talking about the blade, and it just makes me think of the sort of Godric Gryffindor that mm. appears to someone in a moment of, a moment need, of need and like. <laughs> Let me get a moment of Dean, and then boom, he has he's, this awesome sword. He's in Gryffindor. He's in House Gryffindor. All right, now, <laughs> now we know what house you'd be in if, if it was Harry Potter. Yep. All right, and that's really the reason we wanted to check this out. <laughs> to solve the mystery of the house. Yeah, he doesn't even need to take a quiz uh, no. online or whatever. What, 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 is, what house you'd be in for, for Harry Potter? He is a Gryffindor. Yeah. So definitely has to take a, a lot of patience, a lot of dodging uh, for this is what I've uh, gathered as far as, uh, you know, my, my, my research, my homework as far as taking on a boss in um, in a Soulsborne game. Well, and I as as we were watching it, I was like, God, I wonder how many times this player played this before mm -hmm. recording it. Because like he was obviously very aware of what was coming next as Ludwig did thing. Like when Ludwig took a big swing, which he'd done dozens of times before, this player clearly knew like, oh, now is the time when it's going to shoot things at me. And I'm going to yeah, yeah. jump out of the way. So it just made me think like that that level of of knowledge of how the fight is going to unfold i was like god i kind of wish i knew how many, like is this the sixth time fighting it or the 60th yeah. like, <laughs> i could believe it's the 60th yeah for sure 
<laughs> you let us know what you thought about this down below in the comments. And if you uh, played Bloodborne, how how many times it took you to beat uh, Ludwig? Uh, if it was yeah. the sixth or sixtieth time that you, you had to, uh, to fight him. Um, and if you want all of our From Software game reactions, go ahead and check out the description of this video. We got a playlist there for you. Thanks so much for checking out our reaction for uh, this Bloodborne boss battle, Ludwig the Holy Blade. But just keep in mind that our reaction is definitely not definitive.